everybody, this is Grabmark, and as you can see, I have progressed quite a bit in the game, uh, and I now own three fine ships, uh, one of which is a mod and is really cool. Um, okay, well, you can see it's the whale's tail there, and it's, uh, it's, it's a really cool mod. Um, I'll link it in the descriptions I, by this guy. I think his name is Klinger. I've talked to him a couple times on Facebook. He's really nice and uh, his mods are incredible. His ships are incredible. This dock is really cool too. Uh, sometimes it plays music. Sometimes it's not. It's got this little bar here, which is really cool. Where, he yeah, there it is. As you turn away from it, the music goes around in your ears to where, you know, it, it's actually sound as if it's coming from um, this little like bar here. As you turn away, it'll it'll fade away. But what's really nice is that he has acknowledged the people who have helped him build the mod. Uh, so he says Captain Scarlet, Captain Candor, Captain Freaky, Captain BD Carrillo, and it says captains who contributed gold to help this port build new ships. And you can hear that it's playing music. As I turn it, it's really fun when I'm coming into dock too because I can hear the music as I'm pulling up. So, and it looks like he doesn't have a lot of patrons yet. So I would encourage you to support him. I will link uh, the mod in the description if you're on PC, Steam PC. Um, but this is, I'm really having a lot of fun with this mod. I've already built the sloop once, but I got it, uh, you know, sunken. <laughs> hey everyone, this is Grandmark from the future. And here is the sloop that you can build. Uh, on that dock that I'm standing on, it's called the Chalupa, and it was doing this crazy thing here. I don't know what it was doing, but it was twirling all over the place. My bear and I were just hurling everywhere because we were so seasick. But anyway, here's the Chalupa that got sunk. R.I.P. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> the sloop is really cool. It's like the regular sloops, but it's twice as wide, so you can fit an animal on it. Uh, I'll show you my sloop a little later. But this is the white schooner build of his, and it's really beautiful. It really is. Uh, it comes with this wonderful cabin here. Um, you can I don't know if you can tell, but the, the sound is actually stereo, and it's coming from the dock. So uh, anyway, this schooner is really cool. It's white. I, I assume you can paint it. I have not tried because I like it the way it is. Um, and look at how pretty that is. And the gun ports are just beautiful. It's really a cool ship. And this is only one of the ships. There are four ships. Mine is called the Whale's Tail after a local restaurant that we have here in where I live. I live in a beach city, so we, we have a lot of sea themed things in my city. And so, anyway, uh, there's there's my ship, the Whale's Tail, the White Schooner, which you can have too if you subscribe to. I think his name is Klinger, but um, I'll correct myself in the comments uh, later on. And look at that beauty. It's just gorgeous. I have not built the bigger ships yet. Um, and he's also got a Viking ship. And uh, as I said, another sloop, which is twice as wide. These are regular sloops. These are the sloops that came with the game and I've uh, armored them. But as you can see here, he's got the Viking shields on the side of the, the dock here. And he's also got several docks. I've only ever built this one so far. So yeah. Okay, wait, I'm going to check my cannons and make sure that they're... Oh yeah, okay, there we go. Uh, so anyway, uh, enough about uh, his mod. It's a really cool mod. If you are on Steam PC and you use mods, then I encourage you to get this one. Again, look in the comments. Um, but I put these, this is uh, the smithy and the loom and a box here for storage, um, which I, I put on there. Those don't come with the thing. Those don't come on the mod. Oh, thank you, monkey. My goodness, you just poop anywhere. You, you just pooped on my beautiful ship. So this is my fighting sloop. This is the uh, the rustic tortuga. Uh, named it because I, it looks like a, tur a turtle. Let me walk over here so you can see it a little better. 
So I've got armored paneling on it, and this is also a mod. It's called Rustic, Rustic Build or something like that. It's got different pieces on it. It's got that shingled roof, which is really cool, and it's got glass panels, which I really like. This ship here is based on Firespark 81's um, armored ship, armored sloop build that he uses to defeat ships of the damned. Which is what I'm going to do. Oh, that's that's not the button I wanted to use. Let me get that. There we go. So I've got about four members, four crew members who are level 40 and above. And they're all on the ship right now. Actually, you can see them on the cannons. But I need more. I want more, um, more higher level crew members. So. I want to go out and look for some today. Which means, oh, hopefully I don't mess up my, bu my other boat. Nope, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, baby, all right. All right, so we're gonna go out and we're gonna sank us some ships of the damned. Which those things have sank me more times than I can count and it's just annoying when they do it because I'm just not a good sailor. Plus, I've got a speed sail on here. It's not a handling sail. So unless I'm actually going into the wind, I can get in real trouble if I end up in the middle of a group of, of a fleet of ships of the damned. So, but let's see if we can go out and find one that's about level 30, separate him from his buddies and sink him which I've already been sunk today by these guys. Well, hello. Well, there's a red ship right there. Oh, that's not what I wanted to use. That's what I want to use right there. Um, nope. Ah, he's, he's got a bunch of buddies in there with him. So we've got a galleon, 136,000 points. I don't want that. That would be perfect if I can separate him. Whoa, whoa. Or this guy in front of us, actually. But I don't want to get in the middle of these guys. These guys are all over the place, I think, because when I was making the settings for the game, I was like, yeah, let's have a lot of, let's have a lot of creatures spawn. Why not? Well, this is why not. <laughs> Okay, so we've got a couple of them on us. We're sailing right into a group of them, which is how I always get sunk. Because I'm just such a dummy head. Uh, this It would be great to get one of these red ones here. But let's see who's on us. Actually, I think they lost interest in us, but we're probably going to get the interest of these guys here. Now, this guy here would be perfect. But I don't think he's going to chase us. This guy might chase us. Come on. Come here. Come here! Let's play! Oh, you don't want to play with me, chicken? Come on! Come here! Fine. Let's see if we can sink some of these littler guys around him. Uh, and like, oh wait, here. This one's better. Come on, chase me. If I can thin out this herd a little bit. Come on. Somebody chase me. This is a big herd of ships in there. I do need some gold because I did a really stupid thing the other day. Um, I, as I said before in a couple of other my videos, I, uh, I use a controller keyboard combination. And um, it's pretty sensitive. So I had my gold in my first slot. I set my controller down on my leg to use the keyboard and I dropped all the gold in my first slot and I was carrying a thousand gold. 
So I'm pretty much just starting the game. And I'm kind of broke now. <laughs> come here. You come here. Come on, I'm not interested in your any of your crew members. But I would like some gold, please. Okay, make up your minds. Who's gonna chase me? One or the other of you. But not both. Now, I'm worried about running into the border as well, because it's really annoying when I run into the border. And I cross the border while I'm engaged in a, in a ship battle. It's really annoying. All right, he's still on me, which is good. All right, let's let him catch up a little bit. Come on. I really wanted those two brigantines. There were two level 30 brigantines in there, and they're what I want. I want their crew. Is he running? I think he's... This is when I always get in trouble, though. Hey. There we go. When I go to chase them, and I have to sail into the wind. Okay, he ran away. Now I gotta go catch him. Come on, you're the one that, that made me run because of the damn... So get back here so I can kill you! See now, you see that light, that light blue over there? That is the border. I do not want to run into that. Oh, I've almost got this guy. Oh yeah, he's almost done. I've got plenty of resources and stuff in the um, in the box to fix any repairs, to do any repairs on the ship from the water. I don't really have to put into port right now. If anything really bad happens, I do, but um, for, for now I'm good. I gotta get these guys more behind me. Come on. Ow. Ooh, they got me. Okay, that's the bad thing about this is that I'm I'm pretty exposed here. Alright, get him. These my guy should get him pretty well. There we go, thank you. Alright, should we go this way? Let's go this way. I'm not interested in their crew, but I will take their gold. Which they'll probably have like five gold, but... And then I'm going to do a few repairs on the ship since I have to go back in there and thin that, um, that fleet out. So sorry, I know you look cold out there. Go swim to my island. I'll, if you show up there, I'll get you some vittles. No, I won't. Because they won't. All right, let's see what we get. 12 gold coin, a jack-o'-lantern, 10 times bar shot. All right, that's okay. Oy, all right, now I gotta fix everything now. Take this off. Okay, so here's my, my setup in here. I've got my uh, ship resources box, plenty of stuff in there to fix stuff on the fly. And in here I've got more panels and such, and I've got my repair hammers in the very first slot. So this way I can equip my repair hammer. Boom. Uh, what I do want to fix right away are the cannons. Uh, yeah. I don't know why it wouldn't let me fix it like that, but all right. Uh, this cannon is repairing. This cannon is repairing. Ah, this one here. There we go. Okay. I think I can just... Well, you know what? I just hit repair. I, there's a little mini game that you play, and I don't know um, what the advantage is to playing the mini game as opposed to just repairing the panel. But apparently...
Okay, you know what? That's good enough. Let's go. Let's go get those guys. Look at the can- there's all these cannons floating on the water, and that's when they destroy themselves. Looks like we might only have two red ones left, which would be great. Ooh, wow. He is stuck there under that rock. All right. So basically, we're going to try to ram him and then get him to chase us. But now I know that there aren't a lot of other ships out there, which is great. So I'll sail into there, target him, and then turn. Try and get it behind me. Now you want to sail into the wind when you guys when you've got these guys on your tail. Now this is why I fixed my panels before I came. And I also have replacement panels in the ship. I have no side guns whatsoever. Come on, get behind me. If I can get him behind me, he's sunk. He's at 115,000 points. Whoa, 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 whoa. But we want to sucker him in. We want him to keep chasing us. So you don't want to. You don't want to sail away too much. You want to sail just out of reach of his armament. Now there shouldn't be anybody else on the water. It looks like they had a fight amongst themselves. and annihilated each other, which was great. Okay, let's, 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 let's. Getting a little close, getting a little close. Stay out of his range. Make sure there's nothing in front of you. Make sure your sail has the maximum amount of wind in it. Did I lose any panels? Uh, nope. We're good. So I'm interested in their crew members. I would like the gold too, but I really want their crew members. Got a little damage coming, but that's okay. That's what those panels back there are for. Plus, I have replacement panels. I might need to. Whoa, oh, 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 oh. Now, what I worry about are my cannons. I have lost my cannons before. Anybody in front of me? No. I'm good. Okay, he's out of range now. So we can go a little slower. Start seeing the white damage numbers come up. Oh, 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 crap. I've got to sink this guy before we... Before we catch up to those other ships. It would be way better if I could sail into the wind, but they are upwind, so... Oh, shoot. I lost all my panels on the side. Good on the wow, how do I lose panels on the side but not on the A few more shots should do it. And my house is right there. So if I can manage to sink these guys, it should be a clear shot home within the two meters. Okay. Reduce our speed now. Get him, guys. Yeah! 
Nice job! Oh, what's going on? Why am I still getting... Alright. Now I want crew members. I can take two guys out of the water. Actually, I can... But I can... Uh, depending on how many levels I have, I might... I don't want to run over the box because when you run over the box, you destroy it. Okay. All right. Hopefully we can get these guys. Um, so you, you grapple them in if before any sharks get them. Oh, you know what? Plus I want to... Charlotte. Hello, Charlotte. All right. Hit X. Wait, let me get the... Uh, I think there was another crew member who went under the water. Nope. Ugh. This bobbing around is just makes me crazy. Okay, we got two girls. Uh, ugly and senior. Alright. So let's get these guys in the right tame group. I put all these guys in tame group four. And change her follow distance. Okay. Now this is what I wanted here with these. Uh, I wanted crew members. My boys will be happy to have some women on the crew. Huh? Don't you think, ladies? Sure. Behavior. Follow distance lowest. There we go. All right. All right, you ladies come with me. Okay, you stay here. And you stay there. I think somebody over here needed some money. Oh, I, I always make that mistake out on the waters that I forget to, that they want more money when, you, when you're out there. Okay, you're still attached to the, which is really annoying. Here we go. All right, let's get these ladies home. Because we gotta, so what did I get from, okay, I got, I apparently had like 70 coin. I got a swivel gun. Oh wow, that was really crappy. Oh well. Oh, jack-o'-lanterns, okay. Well, that's, I like the jack-o'-lanterns. Let's get these ladies home. I thought there was another crew member out there. Oh, and the sloop's got a veil, uh, level on it, so let's give it some more. Uh, no, 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 don't. There we go. Let's give it some resistance, more resistance. Oh wait, it had more options, properties. Yeah, it had another level. Nice. All right, let's give it some more damage. Yeah, this is where that other those other ships were. Um, hopefully, I don't run into any more ships because I've got a bunch of panels. It's so funny when they get into battles out here, their cannons just stay floating. <laughs> um, totally sailing into the wind. I'm gonna ch just try and get closer to the island. There was another brigantine actually closer. And he got stuck under a rock. So, but I'm not planning on getting into any more battles this morning, so I'll see you back at the base with these two, these two little ladies. Two additions to my crew. By the way, right in front of us. Cannons floating in the air. Okay, guys.
Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. You will notice there are floating cannons on the right. Heads up, floating cannons on the right. Oh. Okay, so here we are. We're getting back to base. We have our two little ladies in here. Uh, I got into another fight at one point because I was stupid and I tried to um, get that other ship that was caught in the rocks. Got greedy. And we've got all these ships right off the coast, so I had to sneak around this rock here and wait for them to get out of the way. But we are home. I had to get the other two sails that I had in the box out. I lost my cannons, um, but I do have my crew members. They are all alive. Uh, and in the, in the boat, got the two ladies handling the sails. And we have a whole fleet right off the coast of my base here which is not great. I hope that they do not come. I hope they don't decide to come over here and mess with my, my base. But you know, this little boat design is really quite cool. Uh, this ship is very sturdy, thanks to all these panels. I keep replaceable panels underneath and I replaceable sails all the time. Um, and so I was able to get home and not get sunk. Not get my ship scuttled. All right, let's pull into the dock here. And we'll, s we'll check out our, our two new little ladies that we have. Okay, see, you can, can you hear the music? The music is playing from the little bar. We'll let all of our little sailors belly up to the bar in a little while here. Okay, here we are. We got two new crew members. Got a couple of ladies in the group. Oh, hello, hello. Which will make the guys happy. And it was an adventure someday. We almost got sank. Uh, because we were stupid and wanted to try to get more bootay. And But we got our new two new crew members. Very happy about that. They are level 40. They're probably more now because I see their experience bars are full. Let's check my old guys. So these were my guys from before. Oh, Nine Toes has full experience. This is my best guy. Um, actually, this guy here is my best guy because he, I think this guy could actually uh, fight. He's got 212 health, melee. I mean, this guy, which is the next best guy. Oh, he's got more. Okay. He's got more health. I knew one of them had more health than the others. So this guy here is the least squishy, but you know, they're not my bear. My bear's got like 1,500 health. So this was my old crew. I'm gonna have to start making uniforms for everybody. Uh, this is my new crew. My t new two na ladies. Girl power girls, that's right. Yeah, high five. I don't know if I have a high five mode, but. So thank you for watching. Uh, and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. And here we go. And from me and the ladies, happy gaming. Bye bye. And from Monkey on my shoulder, who does not have a name. Take it easy, everybody. Bye bye.